Are you born folks? We are about to dive in to get some real insights. So where do you start getting insights? I mean there are so many things, acquisition, behavior, outcome, this and that, a whole lot of things. But the simplest thing or the first place that you can start with is your site search itself. Are people using it? What are they looking for? What pages are they searching at? There's a lot of insights there. Let's take a look. So primarily you can create two segments and this is a standard report. You go to behavior, you go to site search, you have this usage. It's a standard report. But it has some good insights. Let's see. There you go. You see people who did not use site search has a 0.94% conversion rate. But if you use site search, you have a 4.78. That's nuts. Like That's like four times more, you know. These people have a higher probability to convert. So when you're running remarketing ad, rather than running remarketing ads to the entire site, you can write for this segment, right? You spend your money more meaningfully and you get a better ROI. But is that it? Is that it with site search? No, no, not at all. You can also see what people are looking for. Maybe people look for something that already exists, but it probably has a different name on your site. This is an example. People, when we looked at this apparel e-commerce site, people were looking for searching for frogs. The highest number of searches was for frogs, but there was no, not even a mention of the word frogs. You know why? Because the word frogs is not necessarily used by people in Colombo. You know, it's not. People who speak more fluent English use the word dresses and people who are not very good at English kind of use the word frogs. But you see this apparel brand's customer were the people who were outside Colombo. They were focused on outside Colombo, outside the city. So their brand actually, their people actually use this language. But we didn't even have it on the site. So what did we do? We came up with a hypothesis. We found out, okay, a lot of people are searching for frogs and they are not actually buying. I mean, they're not finding it. So what we did was we created the hypothesis that if you add the word frogs to the site in places where there are dressers, the conversion rate will improve. If you have the word frogs more on the site in relevant places, the conversion rate will improve. That was our hypothesis. And we created an experiment for that. What the experiment? We created one control which only had dressers, one variant which, is, which had dressers slash frocks. So we did it in every place where dressers was there. And you know what? We were able to improve our conversion rate by 30 million Sri Lankan rupees. That's like, whoa. And the conversion rate improved by 12%. I mean, that's a big deal. That's a big number. And by the way, that's my girlfriend. I just kidding. That's Jacqueline. She's like, you know, um, so that kind of insights you can easily get with site search and you can get insights that can get you exponential growth. That's it. That's about it.